in Matthew 15, verse 28. The Bible says, And then Jesus answered her, Woman, great is your faith. Let it be done for you as you wish. And her daughter was healed instantly. This is about faith in the power and the goodness of God. Now, that is revolutionary to some. They have faith in God, but a, a vengeful God, a moody God, a God that can be out to get them. I tell you, that is not God. It is not the God of Jesus, and it is a concept that I want you to allow to grow in you. A goodness and a power of God that is always working on your behalf. Now, your home is where you live, but there is a faith-filled atmosphere that you create, and in that atmosphere, no matter where you go, you live there also. So no matter where you go, you feel secure. You feel at home. It is true that you live your life having faith in the power and goodness of God. And because you do, you allow your faith to live through you and you feel so at home and at peace and secure wherever you go. Faith is a belief in the power and the goodness of God. But it is even more. It is also a belief in the power of goodness of God being expressed in you and by others. Your faith is active while you're at home. It's active while you're on the job. It's active when you travel. Faith lifts you when you feel down. It celebrates with you when you feel joyful. And it keeps you centered in the beliefs that aid to your own healing. You have a continuously growing faith in the power and the goodness of God. And because of that, you have a continuously growing life that gets better and better.